<clears throat> Hello viewers, I am still near Latimer House, Ancient Valley, and there's a new uh, placard put up by the Chiltern Society, I think. Describes this area, Roman era to 1700s. Um, in 325 AD, there was an impressive villa along the valley bottom with baths, decorative gardens and colourful mosaic floors. They grew grapes here, perhaps. The valley today provides a habitat for wildlife. There's a grayling fish, heron above, a marbled white butterfly. Here is a map of the area. You can see right in the middle, Latimer, and the little sign, you are here, you know how I love that. There's the commanding officer of this place, Colonel Thomas Kendrick, OBE, at his desk at Latimer House, 1943. But most interesting of all, here is a picture of the secret listeners and army intelligence staff outside Latimer House, 1944. Now, unless I'm very much mistaken, in the top right corner, in the second row, the extreme right hand end, there is Rudolf Hess. I could be wrong, but maybe they interrogated him for long enough and he became one of the lads. And he said, well, I'm not going to escape. And they took him at his word as a, as a gentleman. That would be quite a laugh, quite a, quite a joke. Uh, cricket photographs often have sort of joke scenes to them. But if any of your relatives look like any of these people, let's just say they were. Um, it says here, thousands of, thousands of German prisoners of war came through that in my house and their conversations were bugged and recorded. This vital intelligent work supported the efforts of the co-breakers at Bletchley Park, contributing greatly to the victory of Britain and its allies in 1945. Well, there you go. I'm not sure if thousands did come through here, but there's a lot of huge staff here, a huge number of staff. I reckon there were, some of them were actually the, the, uh, the prisoners of war. Who... Um, uh, the ones who were in Britain at the outcome of the war, a lot were uh, sent to the Isle of Man, I think, and put in, uh, well, concentration camps, not sure what you call them, but I think they could roam fairly freely. Anyway, what a, what a laugh, what a joke, if uh, Rudolf is actually in this picture. That would be marvellous. Cheers. <laughs>